Bone 23 videos. Hello and welcome to episode 77 of the Imperial Battle Conjurer build. We are playing the Anniversary Edition in Survival Mode on Legendary Difficulty and are doing the new quests so we get to know them, so we can use them in later builds. And right now we are here outside of Riel and on our way to probably finish the cause. Let's do it! Walk always in the light or we will drag you to it. I see. Wow, this was a great adventure. Where am I going? I want to go east. To Riften. Because the next goal is here. Red Scar Cavern. We've been there. Well, we passed by when we were at Frostroot Cave and went to Champion's Rest. Mm, it would be even better to sleep... No, I can't sleep at Troll Stone. Or can I? Well, that would be much closer. Because I don't know how big the adventure is going to be. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. And now, let me find out if I can sleep here. Hello? I've been cracking rock ever since I've been able to hold a pickaxe. And I'm telling you, this mine is drying up. And I'm telling you, you're wrong. What makes you so sure? What if I'm right? I don't have a key for that. But I want to know if I can sleep there. Um, let's use one of our invisibility potions. How you can find it. Just to be sure. Nope. That's bad. I can sleep here though. Good. Let's do that. For 11 hours. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Yeah, thank you. You have anything to eat? It's what everybody does, right? You go to your friend, you take his only bed and sleep there for 11 hours, then take all his food, and gold and stuff that you can find. It's free, you know, and he's a friend. I'm rested and I have to go east. Looks easy. It's already warm, but well, maybe not up there. And this is where I have to go. Red Scar Cavern.
Let me put on my fighting gear. It's major, so... Yeah, okay. Let's be ready for that. Now let me take shock. And the saviors hide. Good. Is someone there? Hey. Time to end this. <laughs> okay, first one was fire. The one thing I did not have. Could have slept here. Well, I didn't know that. What's my job here? Locate the Oblivion Gate. No, I will not disguise myself. Why would I? Let's kill them all. <laughs> would have thought there were so many mythic on cultists when in the entire game the original game there is only one Mythic Dawn Chamber Key. I guess I need that. Uh. 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 
See, I expected mages, so I did something for my protection. This place is huge. Okay. Unlock Mythic Dawn Temple. It is the Oblivion Gate. Is this the finale already? I sure hope not. One us. Yep. What? Son of a what? I'm not even a son. Whoa. Completed the cause. There is another enemy here. Daedric Dagger. Nice. This looks good. This place looks great. Really, like a dig side. This is well done. Open the Deadlands. Yeah. And who's that? Soon. White Souls. Another Daedric Dagger. Let's read Wanna's Journal. Enter the Oblivion Gate. Okay. The voice of Maroon Stagen permeates my dreams. At first it was a whisper, but has become a roar inside my skull. The seed of strife and violence plagues this land, the soil enriched by the blood of battle. Tamriel will soon be ripe again for the taking, for my vengeance is at hand, the voice says to me. I must heed his voice. What must I do, my lord? I have spent countless hours, countless days in prayer to Dagon and have heard nothing. I finally took rest and had another dream. Dreams of fire, of smoke, heat upon heat. I was descending into a cavern further and further down. The heat began to cook and blister my skin. But I kept moving, ever downward, fire and smoke, heat and rock. And then I saw it, the very mouth of Dagon, an oblivion gate. With a binding flesh, I then began to have visions of Akatosh, visions of dragons. What could be the meaning of this? I awoke covered in sweat and with a deep sense of purpose. I feel drawn eastward. I must heed the call. Hagen's voice has led me to a cavern deep within the Velothi Mountains. His worshippers used to gather here. I feel their presence. I feel his power. An oblivion gate is buried here. I can feel it. It is my destiny to reach it. I will spend night and day with pickaxe in hand until it is freed from this prison of stone. For nearly two months I have toiled, digging deeper and deeper, stopping only to rest, stone by stone, inching ever closer to my destiny, ever closer to the fires of oblivion. Others have begun to heed Dagon's call and have found their way here 
to me, to our Lord. We are the high priests of the new order, the chosen few who are attuned to his will. As we traverse deeper, the remnants of an ancient mythic dawn temple are revealed like diamond from the rock. Priest Vidas was the first to discover the gate stone. My ecstasy was short-lived, however, when I found like every other gate it had been destroyed. Still, I could feel its power like heat against my skin. Many other pieces like this are scattered throughout the lands of Skyrim, buried deep, lost to time. We shall find them. We shall open the jaws of oblivion once again. Visions of dragons cloud my dreams once more. Images of Martin Septim and Akatosh that make my blood burn with anger and vengeance, black wings unfurling against a red sky. I do not yet understand the meaning of these visions, but Dagon's hatred has become a burning coal in the pit of my stomach, driving me ever forward. Over the last several months, we have searched the deepest reaches of Skyrim and have retrieved enough remnants of the various shattered Oblivion Gates to make one whole again. Its very presence inspires power, awe and reverence. A pact must now be made. Dagon requires that each of us offer a personal sacrifice, a blood offering to prove our dedication. With each soul cast into the fires of Oblivion, his power grows. The liminal barrier is weak here, and the turmoil and conflict boiling in the lands only weakens it further. I must now summon a Dremora Lord to acquire a sigil stone and find a way to open the gate. I have performed the rites as dictated in Liminal Bridges and successfully penetrated the barrier into the realm of oblivion, but my attempts to use the gate as a vessel of transliminal attunement have failed. The portal to oblivion is thin and temporary, as one might expect. I have smelled the sweet sulfur of the Deadlands, but only for fleeting moments of time. I have studied all there is to know of the Mysterium Xarxes. I have been to Dawnstar on countless occasions to observe its last remaining page. Yet the necessary peace has remained a mystery. As I pray to Dagon for guidance and confer with his Dramora, I understand now that a sigil stone is simply not powerful enough on its own. Something stronger may be required to open the gate, but what kind of artifact could hold such a power? I have dispatched the most loyal of my disciples to all corners of Tamriel to search for any artifact or source of power worthy of becoming the key to oblivion. I must remain patient and trust Dagon's will. I have received word from my scouts that a great Welkin stone may be hidden within Riel, an ancient Aelid ruin. Could this be the source of power needed to open the gate? It very well may be. How delicious the irony, an object once used against Dagon becoming the very thing that unleashes his power back into the mortal realm. My scouts are working diligently to uncover any further information they can, and as I continue to pray to Dagon for guidance, his voice says to me, Patience, all shall be revealed in time. Curse the Vigil of Stenda. They have blocked the Pale Pass through the Gerald Mountains, making access to Riel an impossibility. We cannot risk exposing our plans. We must find another way. If we cannot make our way into Cyrodiil by road, we will do so by force directly through the mountains. We have done it once to get to this sacred place, and we shall do it again. I have dispatched a team to begin excavation immediately. Fevered visions haunt my dreams once more, and as the time draws near, I now understand what must be done. The Dragonborn prophecy foretells a chosen one will come forth, their blood and soul blessed by Akatosh himself, the Dova Ki. The time wound will open, and Alduin, the World Eater, shall also return. Though both are fragments of Akatosh's soul, these two will wage war against one another, and as children of Akatosh, they will reap the vengeance of Merun's Dagon. But pain and suffering nor death will satisfy, only the ultimate betrayal will suffice. To open the Oblivion Gate, a ritual of the highest order must be carefully designed, an artifact of untold power must be corrupted, a great sacrifice made, and above all, the Dragonborn must become the unwitting instrument of Dagon's will. I will become the sacrifice, the final step, 
and as the Dover King takes my life with blade in one hand and great welkin stone in the other, they will complete the ritual and become the very key to opening the gate. This ultimate betrayal will shatter the liminal barrier, opening the Oblivion Gate and giving Dagon a foothold into the mortal realm while he rebuilds his armies. It is a divine plan beyond anything I could have comprehended. The world will be bathed in the fires of Oblivion and the blood of mortals will be on the hands of Akatosh. None can be made aware of this plan. It is too fragile, too perfect. It has begun. Alduin has returned. Skorvold has been missing for several days. After witnessing his brother being sacrificed, his spirit broke and he deserted the order, just as I planned. He will seek out the Dragonborn for help, and once his role has been fulfilled, he will be slaughtered. The Dragonborn in their arrogance will continue to the embodiment of ambition much to Dagon's pleasure. They will no doubt seek to obtain the Great Welkenstone. They will then return to me. And when they do, the final act of the ritual will begin. Priestess Anakan has been taken captive by the Vigil of Stenda, but she too serves a greater purpose. Her spirit will not break, but she will lead the Vigil where they need to be to aid the Dragonborn. Where they will utterly fail, the Dovahkiin will succeed. Their success will be short-lived. The Sigil Stone has been destroyed, ensuring the gate will remain open. Moreover, Two of Dagon's Dremora Valkanas, Gatanas and Methods, are waiting in the Deadlands to lead the assault. They are the heralds of the coming siege, and through their works we will unleash a scourge of torment upon our Lord's enemies. The dawn is breaking. Okay. So it seems I was just a toy here. Didn't know that. Interesting. Do I really have to enter this? Okay, let's take a look. Open the Deadland. Hello there. Hello Deadlands. Defeat the Dremora Valkanas. Okay. What is this? Fleshy pod. Ooh, contains treasure. Harada root. Huh. And we step outside. Wow, this looks different. Oh. What do my sore eyes see? The Daedric horse runs away from me. Should I follow it? Madness ore. Ah, this is where I find this stuff. Let's see. This is full of special <coughs> stuff. <coughs> oh, a Dramora. Caitiff. Hello there. quite a few Dermoras here. So far, that is not a problem. Hmm, if I ever need Daedra hearts with a character, this is the place to go. Search the Punished. 
Ooh. Daedric Staff of Judgment. Okay, I will take one. Oh, 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 oh. This guy did more damage than the others before him. You don't get another chance. Life is no Nintendo game. Yeah, but I got another chance. And this is also no Nintendo game. <laughs> nope, I cannot catch this yet. So be more careful. I'm not really looking for any sort of treasure. But this here is really high-end stuff. <coughs> Love it so far. Didn't expect bears here, right? <laughs> so I take it oblivion is something like hell. No. Stop it. Stop collecting treasure to sell. There is my first enemy. What's that? Oh, I'm doing damage. Okay. Retrieve Torment. Yes, got it. Goes down. This is where he was sitting. eat. Nothing is happening. Nothing is happening. Am I sick? No. Am I still playing survival? Yes, but it's not listed here. Why is my stamina reduced? Yeah. 
Stand still. Wait, paralysis rune. What is this? Alteration. Okay. Okay, nothing else is here. Maybe that's because it is hot? This is where I came from, and this is where we'll go now. Impressive, really. I could take a potion of regeneration. I have so many of them. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is where the next one is. Here. Alkin Gatana is a hard hitter. Sorry, I had to kill this this Daedric horse. What? Return to Tamriel? Return to Tamriel. I entered the gate and defeated a Dremor of Valkanas, wielding the weapon Scourge. Stop picking up treasure. I don't need it. Ooh, spell tome. Conjure Daedric Horse. Summons a Daedric Horse to act as your steed. This is cool. Is it conjuration? Yes. I don't need that stuff. It's all just weighing me down. A 
So there is nothing else to do here. Right? Um, let me put Conjure Daedric Horse. Where is it? Summon Daedric Horse. Okay. Let me put that to... Number four. Does that work here? Yes. Whoa. So, using the Daedric horse means not using the Dwarven horse again. And this one can die. So. Oh, it looks great. Look at that. Look at that. Just wow. I love it. Oh. Oh, Modromoros. I thought I was just supposed to get out. Yes, Churro. So, how many Dremoras have I killed? Seven. Not bad. No enemy here. Okay. Ooh, there's a war out here. Vigil of Stender are battling the Mythic Dawn. If I get involved, I could hit a Vigil of Stender. Well, no. Let's not do this. My bears can do a better job. That here before. God, no, we are routed. Fall back. No, I cannot hit him here. Oh, well. Must have run off. So, that was the last one. Now what? Wherever the Daedra hide, the Vigil of Stendar will cast them into the light. I see. Huh? Oh, more fighting. Skyrim is crazy. Crazy with mad people. Walk always in the light, or we will drag you. Yeah, yeah, I'm trying. I still have that weird reduction on stamina. Yeah. Stendar's Why are you mining? You, for the vigil has none to spare. Okay. Nothing else to do here, right? That's weird.
I wonder... These weapons that I found. Torment. Burns the target for 30 points. Targets on fire take extra damage. Yeah, good. Looks like a two-hander. Scorch. Summoned Daedra up to level 36 are sent back to Oblivion. Huh. I take it. My job is just to get outside. I can do that. And now? Oh. Wherever the Daedra hide, the Vigil of Stendar will cast them into the light. Okay, you guys are here. Wherever the Daedra hide, the Vigil of Stendar will cast them into the light. Okay, am I hungry? And the air is chilly, okay. Yes. Um, Loin, Loin, I have to explain something to you. I'm very sorry, but you see, I can summon a Daedric horse now. You know, a Daedric horse, and I can summon it. So, I will use that from now on. So, you did great. You're the best horse ever. And so on. And let's head to Windhelm. Oh, it is cold. I have to put on my warm clothes. And now there's Dramora here. Oh my, what have I done? Okay, I see. The Daedric horse does not have the super stamina of the other new horses. It will suffice. I can summon it. I will never have to look for my horse again. How tired am I? Well, I'm still refreshed. Okay. Which means... I could actually do a few quests here. Tools, wares and weapons. Okay. All for sale at fair prices. Show me. Goods and wares of all kinds and all can be Move on. The longer we travel the, the roads of What have you got? The more empty this land seems. So, what do I do with scorch and torment? Nothing, probably. May your road lead you to warm sands. Move on, friend. I have nothing to sell today. I welcome you, friend. Yeah. Take a look. Nice. 
All this is gone. I hope that you will come to do business with us again. And I need a name for my Daedric horse. <laughs> that tail. Wow. And here is Trader's Post. But you know the drill. Before doing that, let's get up this rock here. Yep, nice view. This is the end of episode 77, in which we finished the cause. And let me tell you this, it was an awesome adventure. A lot of reading, yes but also including a great backstory. If you haven't played it, do it. It's worth it. Not just to gain artifacts or great treasure, but to experience an adventure. In the next episode, we will continue and hopefully finish the missing merchant quest. We will start a matter of pride and finish it. We will finish Smith and Slash and I'm looking very forward to these new adventures. I hope I will see you there. Take Good. Care. Guys.